What's that? It's December 11th? Well, you know what that means. It's time for another coffee. Still haven't heard back from the company, so still don't know what's in these things. Uh, coffee Capture UK, if you are watching. Hi, hello, thank you for watching. Hope you're enjoying these videos. Please tell me what's in each door because I, ju I, ju I just don't know and it's it's slightly frustrating now. Let's find door number 11 and see what the coffee is today. Oh, it's up here on the tree, it's up here on the tree. It's red, still no brand on my door, but it's red. Did we, have we had a red one? I feel like we've had a red one. This one has a white rim. It's not focusing. Oh, there you go. White rim, whoops, white, white, bleh, 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 bleh. let's just make it, shall we? White rim, red capsule. Let's find out what it is. Okay, so once again, we had a coffee that didn't pour very nicely. We have had one that's done that before, and I'm trying to remember if it was the other red pod in here, because we've definitely had a red pod. So I'm wondering if it's this brand, the brand that's in the red pod, whatever brand that might be, it doesn't quite, isn't quite compatible with the Nespresso machine. It feels like there's almost too much coffee beanage in the capsule or in the pod, sorry, um, to get it to pour through smoothly. I'm not really sure, but that is the second one. And what happens is it doesn't give you as much coffee. So normally we're getting about this much coffee and we're losing quite a lot of coffee because obviously it's not all coming out of the machine. Right. Well, it doesn't really smell of coffee. I mean, it does, but I want to say the word perfumed, but I don't think that's what I mean. It's got something to it. There's something, this is, this is a something coffee. Don't know if I'm gonna like it. It's almost like a, maybe pine scent? That's not right, it's not pine. I don't know what I'm talking about. It's got like, it's got a something. This is so helpful, isn't it? Whatever that smell is, it does kind of taste like a, maybe like not, not pine, it's not intense enough to be pine, but maybe like a tree kind of fresh, not really woody, but kind of like the plant part of a tree. I don't know guys, the words. It's got something, but that scent does not come through in the flavor. The flavor is actually, it's not too intense of a coffee, it's not too bitter. Um, whatever that smell is I can get off it is causing it to be quite smooth, so it's quite a smooth drink. The aftertaste has got a little bit of that bitterness to it, but apart from that, that's a pretty good coffee. I would not add milk to this. Once again, still don't know what it is. It would really be helpful if I knew what the brand was or what the flavor of the coffee was so I could kind of discern what these tasting notes are. Uh, what I can say is I am not a coffee connoisseur and I do not know how to discern flavors of coffee when drinking them. I just know which ones I like and which ones I don't. But that is day 11. I will see you all tomorrow for another cuppa. Come join me. I hope you have a cup of coffee with me as well, even if it's, you know, not this one, but. Nice to just sit here and discuss coffee, don't you think?